point guard. All right, so I got our very own Hall of Famer from the chat. He's one of y'all. We bringing him up here to politic with us for a couple minutes up on the panel. Mm -hmm. Shout out to my man, Kendall Daniels. He coming through, man. What's up with you, man? What up, what up, y'all? What up? What up? What up? Hey, Kendall. I'm feeling this morning. Oh, cool. Cool, Wonderful. man. How about you? Man, I'm blessed to be up here. Word. Uh, you the very first Hall of Famer to grace the panel. How does that feel? Damn, I'm the first one? Yeah, first Hall of Famer. Real uno. Nobody before I you. I mean, y'all know who the real one was. <laughs> all right all right uh i know i asked you before you said you just want to want to flow with the conversation but is there any questions or concerns that you might have for anybody i want to know did russ give ox 50 in high school because that's what i'm problems. thinking that's the first thing i thought fam that was the first thing no 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 nah, nah, russ russ didn't but but drew drew gave us something <laughs> oh you had, you played against drew yeah, I play against Drew. And oh, so, so, okay, yeah, so why. you biased. Right. Mm -hmm. cool. You biased. Cool. <laughs> Good to know. Russ didn't, but Drew did. What yeah, about, but uh, real, real quick, my man, what, what, what about us? Like what we do, what, what about us attracted you to us? Like what made you, what made you, what made you continuously come back to check on us? Because there's a bunch not. of other, there's a bunch of other shows out there that you could watch. What made us say to you, go, yo, I like these dudes. I'm going to stick around. For one, y'all on here every day. It's not just a once a week type of show, and y'all not just up here talking about LeBron and Jordan. Y'all actually talking about we talking about if Drew Holiday is a top player in his era. You won't find that on nowhere else. Hmm. Even though he's not a top player in his era, but you won't find that nowhere else. You feel me? At least we giving other people the chance to you know be recognized. Mm -hmm. And then y'all bring people like me up. Like I I don't have this type of platform, so to be up here, y'all just bring you know regular people, get them the chance to get themselves out there. Mm -hmm. And y'all black. Up. Allegedly. Except Allegedly. for Mars. <laughs> Allegedly. Except for Mars. Y'all black, black and we got a UK guy up here. Yeah. Mars is a uh, Caribbean. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right. I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm actually Japanese, but... Oh, okay. And... 100% scumbag, though. 100%. <laughs> great. Thanks, thanks, thanks. Yes. Appreciate it. Man. I know we got company, Mars, well. and I know I got to act right, because we got company, so I'm going to act right. Well, you just no, ignore those chill. rules. Oh, right, <laughs> <laughs> uh, man. Yeah, appreciate you for coming up here, though. Hey, right, so no who did you have? What were your predictions before the finals? Like, um, it, coming into the playoffs, who did you have in the finals? Coming oh. in, well, I thought Denver was going back, going back to back. Shout out Swiper. But... That didn't happen, and then I'm not gonna say pointed, like, sir. I thought Dallas was gonna win, but I'm not a Celtics type of guy. And I see mm. you laughing and cheese and chill, but that your, your guy. Not, bro, not for that. Not for that. Your, I'm not, your I'm... guy, your guy, bro. I don't know if mm. he's the guy. Like I know that they, he can be the guy on a team like this, but like if him and Luca switch roles, I mean, we know who the Finals MVP is if they switch roles. Right. Mm. We don't know who the Finals MVP is right now. Right. Oh, me too. Who? It's Jalen Brown. Drew Holiday? It's Jalen Brown. That's the right. We know who it is. Right. Yeah, we know who it is. But it shouldn't be. It shouldn't be. But well, we talk about Tatum should why be the shouldn't he be, though? Because Tatum should be the best player. I feel like we cut him slack. He should be their best player. Jalen Brown a is fact, good, but Tatum Ron. should be their Tatum should be the their best player. That's a fact, Ron. I mean, throughout history, be the, the best, 10, player be their best player has separated himself on the NBA championship team. That's what he has. The best well, player I think does. he has. I think their best player has separated himself. Ox. You're right. You're right. Jalen Brown did separate himself. That's what Andrew the best does. <laughs> You're right. I, I, I don't. I don't see why that's ridiculous to say though. I was thinking about this last night, like, and I'm not even hating. I'm just saying, is it a possibility that Jalen Brown actually is the best player moving forward? I guess keep so. in mind he's only 27. He is only 27. That's crazy. Right, Jalen mean, Brown still got a, a whole nother tier he could jump up. I know it's... But so does Tatum. Tatum, Tatum has him. like two tiers he could jump, yeah, not just yeah. one. But Tatum so, so, should be the so best So with that being, so with that being, So with that being said, the skill from a, from a skill set, he's I, from a skill set, we're looking at a better player. But I think the ticket, ticket made a really good point that Jalen Brown uses his skills better than what Jason Tatum uses his skill set. That's all mental. So 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 now we're talking about it being Jason Tatum's mentality that's holding him back. It has to be because he's too talented. He's too skilled for him not to know how to use the skills. Mm. That has to be all mental. It's not. We're not talking about Torian Prince. We're talking about Jason Tatum. We're mm. talking about a, a, a 
this is a, a bona fide star. Like, this sure. is a, a legitimate top 10 guy. He shouldn't be out here. Like he's doing the other stuff. He shouldn't be out here having these tour dates. Like he shouldn't be shooting like that. Like he shouldn't be having these turnovers, especially not against Dallas. He's not playing a good defense. They're not out there putting clamps on him. They, they're out there with who's guarding him? PJ and PJ Derek Jones. Like he, he should be averaging 31. I know you're talking about he had 31 last night, but he should have had 31 all the night. That should have been on a Tuesday. Literally, but it wasn't. On a and Tuesday, he's 16 in the NBA. Well, it was on a Wednesday. I have a problem with that. So, and, I, 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 and I, to his point, to his point, and I said this before, that I think he's so worried about what happened in 2022, him repeating that, that he's playing not to, not to be bad. I think he's playing to, I'm going to play the right way. I'm going to make sure that I'm not the reason why we lose. I'm going to make sure that I make the right pass. I'm going to make sure that I don't turn the basketball over. And I feel like that's tripping him up. No. I feel like I feel like that's what's tripping him up. Instead of him just going out there and playing the way he knows how to play, instead of worrying about not playing well. I think that's what's tripping him up. Is it possible that you guys are just wrong about how good he is? I hope so. I hope that's the case. I hope he's not as good as I think he is. Because if he is, then he's a playoff dropper. So. Yeah, because may- maybe what you see and then what you- you're actually getting, maybe he is just what you're getting and you just think he can be more, but really this like is Like Anthony Davis? He- I mean, if you want to put AD in that bracket, mm-hmm. yeah. Some or people, like some people yeah, Davis. the people were like, AD could be the best in the world, but he just doesn't put his mind to it. Maybe he's just not as good as you think. So maybe you're just holding him to a case. standard. I, and he's I, just I really well, here's the, the difference, tomorrow. Mars. I don't think that he could be the best player in the league. I don't think he's that good. I don't think that either. And I don't think he could ever be that good, to be quite honest with you. I don't think that he does what Joker does. I don't think that he can raise to that level of of Giannis. I don't think he could be that good. I do think he could consistently be a top five player in the league, though. I do think that. Consistently? I I think he could consistently be a top five player. And I know that matters. I know that 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 matters. I know, I know, I know, I know that the play because I'm, I'm an advocate of the playoffs, and what you do in the postseason matters. When you raise your game in the postseason, that elevates the legend of whoever, you, whoever it is that you are. And he's shown these NBA Finals that maybe, just maybe, and I'm not going to go with the young logic. You've been in the league seven years. Listen, I'm killing that. I'm tired of hearing that. Yo, he's young. He's 26 years old. He's been in the league seven years, so yeah. he knows what it looks like. It's not like this is the first time he's been here. He knows what it looks like. I can't keep using the excuse of, well, he's going to get better. He's going to get better. I've always, I'm, I'm, I've still, I've stood on the logic that by year five, the numbers that you see, this is probably who this guy is. The skill set may improve. Some seasons may improve. Sure. But I still think that he could consistently be a top five player if he performs at that level in the postseason, and I've but seen him have he, great. But I, I've seen him have great postseason games. I've seen him have great postseason runs. I've seen that. But you can't. I, I'm. I think the thing is when you say that to me, I'm thinking about the players that have been consistently locked in the top four. For instance, are Giannis, Joke, Embiid, and Luca in the last, let's say, three seasons. I think even if people don't like Embiid, Embiid's still been a top five ish player in the regular season. And then SGA is now into that conversation in back-to-back first-team All NBA seasons, and he finished number two in MVP voting. Mm-hmm. Uh, is SGA going somewhere? Like, is he disappearing? Like, you know what I mean? Like, I haven't seen Tatum operate at that level either. And the Thunder were really good. They won fifty-seven games this year. They also have a really good team, but SGA was clearly better than Tatum this year. So the question then comes down to like, is Tatum ever going to be able to show that kind of consistency as those other guys have for the last several seasons? And that's when you say, like, you think he can get there. Well, I'm saying, like, all those players are in the same age frame as him, and they're all better, like, pretty considerably better. And they've all are all more consistent. Well, wait, a minute, though, consistent. Swiper. Uh, wait, wait a minute, though, Swiper. Wait a minute, though, Swiper. You brought up SGA because SGA mm-hmm. this season, like you said, he was better. And I'm not sure that I can argue that because this season, th- this season may be. But last season and the year before that, like we weren't having this conversation two years ago. We weren't having first, this conversation. He, he, we he weren't was having this into conversation. It like, right. I can, and, and but that, he grew that, into that, it and passed him. That part I can get with, right? That part I can get with. Now, when we're talking about SGA, is it this or is it this? What, what, what are we doing with SGA? Well, I think SGA was just better this year. I don't know. Yeah, okay, like this year. And I know that. And, and again, t- Swipe, I know that you like mm-hmm. to, I know that you like to deal primarily in the now. I like to mm-hmm. deal in I like to deal in the now too, but I also like to deal in what led up to the now. I can't just exclude what happened four years ago or three years ago when I played at a first team All NBA level. I can't exclude what I did when I was in the playoffs three years in a row. Don't get me wrong, that he didn't perform well in the finals, 
But we are talking about an Eastern Conference Finals MVP. Well, I think the thing about first about team NBA, though, Chill, if you're, you're having an honest dialogue about this, mm-hmm. the last two years, he wouldn't have made it this year if Embiid had played 65 games. And last year, if you got two centers on first team NBA, he wouldn't have made it last year. Because Jokic would have made it over him. Because okay, Jokic made second problem. team okay. See, see that, that's the thing, though. No, well, SJ where... and Luka missed the playoffs, so. But that, well, that's that, that's and I I had a problem with that. I thought Donovan Mitchell should have been first team All NBA. But that that's a, that's another conversation. Wait, what's that got to do with uh, Tatum taking that, the spot? Maybe Jason maybe Jason Tatum's spot isn't the one that gets taken. Or are you just saying they can allow three front court players and not go? Well, no, I'm saying I don't I don't but I don't know if they, they would have uh, taken uh, off Luca or SGA last year for Tatum if it made room for. I mean I don't know maybe maybe they would have. I'm just saying that like had it been traditional rules, I mean Jokic obviously would have made it, but maybe maybe they did take Luca take Luca off. I don't know. I, I I probably wouldn't have done that personally. Wait, but I had like, yeah. That's what that that's why that's why the center spot. Tatum, that's why fourth in MVP. Yeah, mm-hmm. he was fourth in the league MVP both that year. He averaged thirty a game. I think he was thirty and eight. Giannis, last year. Jokic, and MB. Yeah, he was thirty and eight last. I'm year. pretty sure he'd make it. How many people do y'all know were fourth in MVP that actually had a chance of winning it though? Like we say, no, that I'm not saying no. He wasn't in the MVP race. I'm just saying exactly. first. I didn't, team and, and I didn't say that. No, I'm, so I'm, to I'm, me, I'm, that, I'm, that doesn't matter. You being fourth in MVP doesn't matter because you didn't even have a chance of winning it in the first well, place. It doesn't I, matter I, when I, it comes to making first team All NBA. And and not only that, I'm talking about. Well, yes, that that matters, sure, but. If we're doing a position, well, didn't Brunson finish fifth this year? And we're yes, talking uh, the way he I look at first NBA, I'm not judging you off team. Brunson can judge you as an individual. Sure. Oh, Tatum. So him sick. being oh, first in the Eastern Conference, he was six. Absolutely. Yeah, Tatum was six. Mm-hmm. Why? But like, if because I'm playing, I'm not judging you not, off. off, off a but that's where he belongs, though, Shield. That that makes sense. Like Tatum finishing between fourth and sixth every year. Okay, but let, let, let's just say that that's let, let's say that that's true, and he didn't have a chance to win it. I don't want to discount that he's playing at that level, though. Wait a minute. That's, just no, that's really I, good. That's, if just, right. Just because I just because MVP, I didn't win the league MVP, MVP level. One more time. If he doesn't have a chance to win the MVP, how is he playing at an MVP level? Well, I am because I'm playing at a top five. I'm one of the top five players just because I don't win it. Well, so if that's the you're case, you're playing in the top five, but you're in a tier by yourself at five, and the other four are. Oh, in now he could. Now, <laughs> now he could. Now he's good. <laughs> chill in the box. <laughs> Wait a minute. Hold on. I, I want to make sure I'm understanding them correctly. Because I'm sorry, I didn't hear what you said. Because you got people okay, talking. Okay, let me let me break it down <laughs> to you, time. chill. So you get you get Giannis and B, Jokic and Luca. They're sure. in a tier. By themselves, there's a tier with nobody else in it, and then you can get to Tatum and SGA and all the other guys. Okay. Tatum still has to go up another tier that nobody else is in to even get to being having a chance to get to that MVP. He won't even touch an MVP like no time soon because you got Wimby coming. Yeah, you, you still got Jokic. Luca probably basically got it locked for next season. So like, I don't see where he comes in and is just this. Which is interesting. MVP, this, 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 the guy, like, because he Which plays on great teams. So how like, much longer I, until Wimby better than Tatum? By the way, without all show. the talent, like I know how Luca, Luca looks with four months. Derrick Jones out there. I don't know mm-hmm. how Tatum looks without all of guys. Right. To me, that sounds like a front runner. No, like, that's just me. Now, re- let, let's rewind a little bit, and that's a really interesting point you just brought up. So, one, you got to build that unit around Jason Tatum, like. Luca was growing with that unit. All right. Don't get me wrong. With 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 Daniel Gafford, he just got those guys. But for the most part, they built that unit around Luca's skill set. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say that Jason Tatum and Luca, you told you you take these two guys out of the lineup, what's gonna be different? Those two guys are different players. That's number one. They're completely different players. So they would build that unit around Jason Tatum's skill set. Number two. You sound like what, what what you sound to me like is if I play at an MVP level, because I don't win the MVP, it doesn't matter if I played at that level. No, so if it, I get to so, so if I get to the champ, so if I get to the championship, if I didn't win, it doesn't matter that I played at a championship level. Now I can't discount that. I can't discount that. And I'll never like, discount so that. So like are we going to I don't think that's what he's championship saying, team sure. when they lose tonight and get swept? Are they a championship team okay. because he they he got to the final? I know Mars. I hope to God they come back so I can come back up here and see chill face. But let's say let's just be realistic and say they lose tonight. Is is Dallas a championship level team? Because they got swept. They were you said a sweep isn't close. I don't so think you tell close. me. Sure. Okay, so if you're not close to winning the MVP, how are you playing at an MVP level? But not the every, same logic should apply. Well, wait a minute. Not everybody if, if I if if I if I am num, if I'm number four in league MVP votes, sure, that doesn't mean I'm not close to winning it. You're only number four because Embiid didn't play enough games. That what well, that was like well, well, how about last year? That was last year when it La- won it. Last year, last that year. That was last year when it Jason, won it. He last year, Jason, number, Ta- Jason Tatum came fourth. Jason Tatum came fourth and got zero first place votes. 
he didn't have a chance to win. The only people who got first place votes were Embiid, Jokic, and Giannis. Everyone else got zero first place votes. So, so Kendall, by that, he wasn't close. Was. So, Kendall, he was only fourth because so somebody... The case, we he, was four, he was, he was, he was fourth because he was the best was player on the best team. So the 30 and 8 doesn't matter? No, we're not doing that. Hell no, 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 it doesn't matter. He's just saying he didn't play at the level of Embiid, Jokic, and Giannis, so therefore he didn't play at the level needed to win an MVP. That's what he's saying. Like, it's like it's like saying in twenty six. I always go to twenty sixteen because it's the easiest example. Play. It's like saying in twenty six. It's like saying in twenty sixteen that because Russ came fourth in MVP, he played at that level. When we know that Steph ran away with he played at an MVP level. Not mm. how do you play at an MVP level if you got someone who gets every single vote? Literally, if you don't get one vote for MVP, well, you already know how I feel about that. So no one thinks you're the MVP. I Not one Kawhi person. Le- I thought Kawhi Leonard should have got a vote that year, but that's 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 something. But you're the only person who thinks that. Everybody else voted. <laughs> he put us on the big stage. It's crazy. <laughs> that's okay. I can keep slow roasting them. Keep going. Mm. <laughs> I'm, I'm just saying, chill. Like, chill. I'm not gonna lie. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. You're probably my favorite up here. But this is Jason Taylor oh, stuff, man. You're too smart for this. Like, you know, like, like you see it. Like to me, he's like lesser Scotty Pippen. Like. And that's not a knock. Scotty Pippen is an all-time Scottie? great. But when I look at Jason Tatum, I see Nothing like Dollar Tree Scotty Pippen. Because oh, Scott, like Scotty <laughs> is everything that Tatum was, but I Scotty was there in the big games. I think he was better than Jason Tatum. I won't. He even won't. Argue he, that. No, no, there's no thing. Scotty you Pippen know he was better than, better than Jason Tatum. I won't argue that. No, way better. Never than Jason Tatum. Never get me to argue that. To me, my issue is is what you what you dudes are trying to sell me right now. What you dudes are trying to sell me is that if I play at a level. Just because I didn't win a Grammy, I don't know. I, 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 I didn't sell 10 million records, but I got nominated for a Grammy. That doesn't mean that I, I should... But, but if Adele... But if no one voted for you to win it... And then why am I even in it? Clearly somebody voted because for Because you have to have four nominees. There has to be five nominees. The ballot has five When Adele put 25 out, you won't win it. Then we need to take that out, then. If the ballot had three, Jason Tatum would have had zero votes. Then we need to take that out, We do. Chill, it can't be an award show if it's not nominees. You can't just... It can't just be Taylor Swift up there and you're like, okay, well, Taylor Swift, you're the only nominee. We would know who's going to win the award ahead of time. So if I don't have a chance to win... Right, so if I don't have, a, I don't have any chance to win, like you just mentioned last year, Jason Tatum didn't get any first place votes. Why even mention me then? He has no chance of winning no, in the last mean, three years. Why even mention me? But he wasn't what? even in the conversation no one, to win no the last three years. Right. We just, no, we just no know he came anyway. because the list comes out and he was in fourth. But everyone knows the MVP race was Jokic, Giannis, and Embiid. Everyone those, knows that was those the last, last, Jason those Tatum. Last Jason Tatum three, was right. the he best of the rest. Okay, so for That's now on, the best so of the rest. Now when I see you, dudes, I don't want to hear nothing about Jalen Brunson being in the top five of the MVP votes. Yes. I don't want to hear nothing about none of these other dudes that being but in the top five. But you brought it up to the Finn Tatum. No one knows that. No one knows who came fifth in MVP in 2020. Who? No one literally. No one knows who came fifth in MVP in 2020. Does anybody? I don't even remember who won. I'm it was sorry, Kawhi Davis, Leonard. No one knows it was Anthony, Kawhi. Anthony no Davis, I think Anthony Davis came in sixth place that year. AD I was sixth, yes. But no one, yeah. because they- Didn't, the, didn't was, Sabonis finish it was seventh this year or something? Seventh and Sabonis, no one asked why defense player of the year vote. One more time, I'm sorry. Like, did, I said Sabonis got a defensive player of the year vote, and you talking to me about MVP votes. Like, they take those seriously. Of course they do. You think so? You think they take those seriously? If I think most people do. I think some people. Yeah, that guy just wasted his vote for whatever yeah, reason. That guy just. So I'm serious. saying, so, we, so you we're not just not voting for anybody. We, we, we're not just that guy. For, that guy just voted. They, they are just I mean, voting for, for anybody. Come on, man. I, 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 the, the, the league, league, not everybody league, does that. Not the league leading. Don't try and justify it to as defensive player. I'm not justifying it, Moss. What I'm saying is, is that we're not just voting for anybody. They are voting for just anybody. They let him. They let him be win the MVP, so Jokic wouldn't win three straight. They're voting for anybody. Well, wait a minute. MB should be the MVP this year. He played 65 games. That wasn't his MVP last year. His MVP would have been this year. Jokic should be three this straight. Year. So they're voting for anybody. If he would have played 65, MB had that Well, they're not just lock. voting for anybody. I mean, they Joe are just Embiid voting did. for anybody. They're well, wait, what, they, if, they were, if they were just voting for anybody, then it wouldn't justify what, what Joel Embiid did last year. He did lead the league in scoring. Yeah, Joel, I think he was 30 and 11. Played, played, so they're not just voting for anybody. Wait a minute now. That, you can also yeah, we're not doing that. that. The voting flipped to the moment Kendrick Perkins started accusing Right. Right. Like, like, you're saying that like, we racist. have the most respectable voters. Like, the voting just flipped. Like, it's not Kendrick Perkins up there voting. Like, well, he already said he's renouncing his vote. Good. And he I'm, should. I'm, 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 so when? That's, that's just when did he say that? When, he Rudy, that when, Rudy, Rudy, got, when Rudy saw it. When yeah, Rudy is he serious? Yeah, he said he's renouncing his vote. Yeah, he is he said, serious? Yeah. Who do you yeah, think you are? That's what I'm saying. Jesus Christ, you don't hear him say he's Jesus? They don't take that seriously. 
Like, like they took Kyrie <laughs> off top seventy five. NBA voters do not care about who's actually balling. They just go. But AD in top seventy five, chill. That's right, because because AD is one of the seventy five best players. Yes, he, he is. is. But Kyrie yes, also he is. should be. Yeah. Uh, and and who's exp- now Kyrie? Kyrie being a top seventy-five player all time. Who comes off? I, Chill, maybe, maybe maybe them older dudes. Maybe, yeah, maybe, 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 maybe them older him. dudes. I'm anybody? Good with that. Any? I don't even know who Bill Sherman is. Do you? Sean oh, respect, no. He was he was a, he was a sniper back in the day. Yeah, he was. that's not me trolling. He was a sniper. Mark. He made like a, he made like Mark. a half court shot. Mark, I'm only up here for a few minutes, bro. Please, please, bro. Please, be for real, bro. <laughs> Dave the Bush he was. Real, bro. Bill Sharma was a sniper. <laughs> Dave Mark, the Bush Kendo is speaking for the people in the <laughs> chat. He's the voice of the chat right you now. Can, you you to be serious, Mark. I'm make it like I'm a good for David short in an All-Star game. I'm good with that. So did Anyway, Jeff anyway, chill. Jason Tatum is just not a. He's just not that guy. Moral of that story. Yo, chill. Bring it. Bring it, Kendall up here. I'll be glad when we come back to this conversation. In, in another year, or we so. won't have to because they're gonna Why? win the finals and he's gonna win the finals averaging 20 points a game. 22, actually. 20. Oh, no, he, he won't. Yeah, I'm 22. saying we bet, we bet, we bet he's not gonna score 20 today, right? No, right. we didn't bet anything. You just well, look at how we're talking about him. We sit here talking about him like, is he gonna score 20 tonight? And this is the guy. Hmm. I mean, do you, about, to, do you have to score 30 to be the guy? guy? Do you have to score 30 to be the guy? Apparently, like, that's the that, that's the no, that's, that's, not, the that's not what the, that's, that's not the, it. That's, that's the not it. Don't don't twist Kendall's words. Don't I'm, twist I'm, I'm, I'm asking. I'm, I'm asking a question. That's the measuring stick. I'm trying to say yes. That's the measuring stick. Because Jalen Brown has scored thirty as many times as Jason Tatum in this series. Right. So that's why I'm it's asking. not even about that. I feel like Tatum's shot selection is. It's not even his shot selection. I'm seeing him miss bunnies. Like, what are you doing? Like he did miss three laps in game two. He did. You remember? Y'all remember game one? Not that good at watching around sometimes. I mean, that's his point. Yeah, oh, he, he's a flawed player. Like, uh, you didn't go tell me twice. I'm just saying. I, I, don't think I, I know he's a flawed player. But hey, he chill. Has, like, Kendall coming up here is like when the just, Detroit Pistons got Mark Guard. He's the best small forward in the NBA. One more time. I, I, I just I've heard you say that Tatum is the best small forward in the NBA, but I don't know if 40 year old LeBron is playing like this. That's just me. But 40 year old LeBron is not playing like this, and I think LeBron plays small forward. I think so. Jason Tatum plays power forward, but. I That's true. He's, he's not even too. a small forward, and if he, he he's definitely not the best power forward. So Boston, he does play power forward for them. So though, Boston Jill, just he's listed as power forward. No, they just. If Demar Derozan is listed as a small forward, I'm, I'm sorry, if Demar Derozan is listed as a power forward, which Chicago because he needs to play. He can't play small forward. He can't play guard. Demar Derozan was Demar Derozan was listed as a power forward when he played power forward. Demar Derozan has been listed as a. Well, when Patrick Williams is there, he plays small forward though. Like he's he's two guard though, and everybody. No, he's not. He is not a two anymore. Years ago. Chill. Last time he was a two. Last time he was a two. I have a shadow fade. Chill. Shadow fade. The league has downsized to a lot of twos are now playing the. We don't run him at the two. The same way a lot of threes are now playing the four. Like the league has gotten smaller in terms of like at the wing position. So guys who used to be twos are playing three, and guys who used to be three are playing four because teams want more ball handlers on the court. Like why we have to not be don't know? Because we run, we'll run. Yeah. So Jason Tatum plays the four. Caruso and Kobe White, Zach Levine, and and whoever. So there's no room for him to play guard anyway. Kendall, you said well. As in me, as in us. Why wouldn't it be room for him to play guard? I live in Chicago, Ron. What else am I gonna do? Uh, Oh, 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 so you 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 going through pain? You you going through pain? Okay. Yeah, I know I'm going through pain. My favorite player is Derrick Rose, bro. I know, I know. It's real. Oh, yeah, let me... Okay, if your favorite player is Derrick Rose. This is a question I was asked a, uh, a, a week ago. Derek, peak Derrick Rose or Shea? Who's a better player? Ooh. Who's a better player? Yeah. Ooh. Skill for skill? Better at basketball. Someone says better at peak Derrick Rose. Shea, Shea is better. better at basketball. Hmm. Even though Derrick Rose is my favorite player, Shea does more things better than Derrick Rose, yes. Hmm, okay. Yo, so, so but, Kendall... Y- y'all get a chance to redraft a player, and you get Derrick Rose MVP season or this year's SGA. And Derrick Rose is for the, for the next seven years injury free. I'm gonna take Derrick Rose because he was 22 and Shea is 25, so I'll take Derrick Rose. That's easy. Good that's argument. not that's not fair. Derrick Rose is 22. If Derrick if healthy Derrick Rose at 25, y'all don't want to see that. Like people. We don't even have to get into that. There would be no Russell Westbrook conversation. There would just be Derrick Rose. And I know, Chill, you thought Russ was better and all of that. But yes, he was. If you gave Derrick Rose yes, three years of, of I ain't listening to none of this. perfect I'm development. Not, I ain't listening to none of this. Oh, you're right. You don't nope. have to it's going in and out. It's going in one ear and out one ear. I ain't listening to none of this. I'm good. 
That's fine. I'm That's straight. fine. That's fine. That's fine. You're a Jason Taylor guy. Yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Kendall, my man. Appreciated you for coming through. That was a good it's, Hall of no Fame. it's Hall of Fame Fridays every Friday. So yeah, this was great. Might see you next give, week. Give Might see this you the great. following week. Give me some. Give me some, oh, brother. Absolutely. I don't know what's that. Absolutely. Give, give me some. I've never been alive. Good to talk good to you, brother. Oh, Absolutely. Good. <laughs> good to talk to you, brother. Absolutely. Yeah, all right. Next time I'll be up here, I got this the top 20 for y'all. This dude, no bad. Mm, I like bet, it. Bet. I like it. This dude, hold on, Ron. Get this top 10 before you go. Get this top 10 real quick. Get this top 10, Ron. Hold on. No, we're going to get him again. This dude over here. It's Friday every week, guys. This dude is not a goofy. He know basketball. I like it. Yeah, I ain't going to lie. Next time, instead of bringing back Dion. Kendall right here. Right. Why do y'all okay. Hey, so we got Dion from Ohio and my man Kendall from Illinois. Or I like Kendall. No, from not Illinois. Chicago. Kendall from the shot, man. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. Kendall, my bad, my bad. Kendall my bad. from yes, sir. I like this dude. He know basketball. All right, my man. We'll catch you again. soon. Yes, sir. All right. All right. I'll be mm -hmm. smooth. Yes, sir.